And so with that, we transition to the other really great thing about the Plaza Art Fair is the fact that they have food booths set up to feature local restaurants and chefs. We've got John here from Starker's here. Restaurant, and Absolutely. you are making something that's kind of my, uh, I don't know, my guilty pleasure. Guilty pleasure. <laughs> okay. Absolutely. We're going to make Creole beignets today, and this is such an easy recipe. You can make them at home. It doesn't take any time. And who doesn't like donuts? Is it, it's you pretty know? much a round donut hole. Yeah. You're just giving it a fancy name. Absolutely. You it's, my a, it's, language. A, it's a Cajun Creole <laughs> okay, uh, okay. donut. So we're just going to um, start with a couple of eggs and some milk, and we're going to whisk those together. Okay. How about I whisk? Absolutely. Whisk, whisk away. And All right. we just love these donuts. They're really uh, fun and easy to make. You know, who wouldn't want to wake up in the morning and have their husband make these donuts for them in bed? Uh, yeah, or the wife's making them for the family, and well, then the husband complains about the house smells like clay all day. Okay, no. so we're going to do this. So we, so we have that whisk together. Okay. Then we're going to add in our dry ingredients. Okay. We have some flour, some sugar. It's a good a, amount. A little bit of uh, baking powder. A little bit of baking soda. I'm just going to mix all that together like yep. you normally do your drying for any recipe. Absolutely. Okay. And just a pinch of salt. Okay. Then we're gonna, you can whisk gonna that, that in, in there. Oh, Let's wait. whisk these together first, oh. and then we'll put them together. There we Look, go. I, that way they'll be nice and light. We get that baking powder oh, in there. Oh, nice. There we go. That saves a step of sifting it. <laughs> then we're going to mix in the wet ingredients. This is so easy. I mean, you're going to have donuts. And how do you get to be one of the restaurants featured while you're working at the Plaza Art Fair? Is it a big to-do like it is for the artists? Well, um, just like, uh, you know, the, all the other artists, we're, we're, I'm a plaza merchant. Starkers is on the plaza. Sure. And uh, we, all the plaza restaurants, almost all the plaza restaurants, I believe, have an art fair um, booth down there. And we'll be serving... Um, you know, different kinds different of things. things. We have chicken andouille gumbo, shrimp etouffee, fried green tomatoes. Uh -huh. We have an extensive menu down there. And so you're just going to mix that up and ball them and then fry it? We just, all you have to do is so just simple. take these. Okay. And just spoon it into your oil that Can you, you have Can you get hot. these this weekend? Absolutely. We are, okay, we are serving the Creole beignets as well. So you have to know to ask for the Creole beignets. Absolutely. And you say that's the donut hole I saw at NBC Action News. That's <laughs> right. And so, I think we should have the recipe. Okay. Good to know. It's on our website, NBCActionNews.com. You are the owner and the chef. Absolutely. That's kind of cool that you're kind of going after your dream. Absolutely. I'm a, you know, a young entrepreneur, and I just love uh, having our local community. And I think the Plaza Art Fair is a way to showcase local art, local culinary items and come down and visit us and take right, a taste. so I'm going to taste it. Look at all this powdered sugar I'm going to get all over my face. Mmm, <laughs> oh, I'll have two. All right. <laughs>